Hi everyone and welcome back to Heavy Beat. This week I've released Alpha 3 and in this video we're going to go through what you'll find in this version of the game. For this version, I've added the runner mode to the game. You can now once again ride toward the horizon to your heart's content. The mode also includes some changes from its original form. Apart from the slight tweaking of some values such as maximum velocity, bonus speed and so on, runner contains a new kind of tile called the sliding gate. This tile moves up and down to the beat of the song and encourages you to try to slide through the opening for a small reward, such as a power-up or a diamond. You can also find hook tiles high above the rest of the platforms that you can use to pull yourself up from imminent danger, or to try and gain a vantage point to know where you want to land next. Contrary to tower mode, runner allows for multiple deaths, so even if you fall off you'll still be able to finish the song and try and beat your previous high score. Overall, the game is a lot more stable now. Switching from game mode to game mode or going back to the main menu is seamless and there are no loading screens in between. Alpha 3 will be the final publicly available alpha for Heavy Beat. As we're gearing up for a full release by the end of August, the game will pass through one or two closed betas, where a bunch of features and tweaks will be added in preparation for the release. These include changes to the in-game UI as well as the main menu UI, revamped options menu with config file saves, multiple color palettes for the game's visuals, a robust song file saving system where the player can import a bunch of songs at once and the game will remember them for next time, a high score saving system where the player will be able to see their own high scores on each game mode and song, as well as a few more tile types for each game mode. That about wraps it up, head on over to each.io to try out Heavy Beat. Thanks for watching.